What's up guys, it's Trevor with Embers Fireplaces. Today we're in the electric fire fireplace room. You know, even in our showroom, we have a lot of choices. It can be a little bit overwhelming. And the reason is, is out of all of our categories, probably next to barbecues, the electric fireplace category is probably the most flooded marketplace, which means tons of manufacturers are racing to this. There's tons of different products, tons of options out there. And it's super confusing to know what is gonna be the right electric fireplace for you. Thankfully, you have us and our awesome channel, of course, which by the way, you need to subscribe to, little plug there. But today, long awaited, you guys have been asking for this for a while, it's because we've been waiting for new models to come out. We have a brand new, pa 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 top five electric fireplaces, my personal five favorites. Let's go. So before we get started, don't forget we're in the Denver, Colorado area. So if you're local here, you can also come down to our showroom and check these products out for yourself. Also, like we mentioned, you have to subscribe, like this video, helps us to keep making videos like this. Now, keep in mind, these are my top five favorite. This is my personal five. Um, sound like Charles Barkley, like, you know, the old T-Mobile commercials. Anyways, it doesn't matter. Um, <laughs> what I like as my top five may not be what you like. And electric fireplaces, there's a ton of flexibility, um, a lot of subjectivity, I guess you could say, on, on what people like. Because the biggest thing, I think, driving electric fireplaces is the aesthetic appeal to them. And that's a very personal choice. Also, some may not fit your install needs. Some units are 12 inches deep. Some are 6 inches. Some are 4. Some require water. Some require just power. Some can have 220 for extra heat. So we'll talk through all these features as we go through and think about your personal needs, what's important to you and then apply those features to what your needs are. That way it can help you narrow down your choice. And again, don't take it as like a, a rite of passage. Like, oh, Trevor said this one's number one. A lot of people do that. Or so he said this is number three. Pick what you like. This is just some suggestions. There's my personal five favorite and I'm gonna tell you why. Okay, sometimes we sneak in an honorable mention because five just isn't quite enough. That's no exception here. Um, it's really hard to narrow down five fireplaces. So we snuck in a six one. This is the Amante bespoke uh, symmetry model. The reason we snuck it in is actually one of our best selling electric fireplaces out of everything we sell. Um, I'm not gonna go through all the features like I normally do because spending that much time on each unit, this would be like an hour long video. So I'll include links for all these if you wanna see the full length videos of features. So I'm just gonna hit some bullet points here. This comes in three sizes. This is a 50, 60, and 74. The reason it's such a good seller is people love the flame pattern. Chris is our new videographer here. He's not familiar with the industry at all. What did you say about this fireplace? I like the tips of the flames on this fireplace compared to others. Yeah, so it was the flame itself. So this particular model caught Chris's eye out of everything in our showroom. Um, just kind of coming in here cold. Uh, no pun intended, it's a fireplace section, so we can warm you up real quick. Uh, <laughs> and, and that's the case for a lot of people. It's a fan favorite for sure. The flame pattern is another one reason why. It also has sound. You can adjust the speed of the flame, which I'm not gonna show you. Again, you can go watch that full length video if you want. And you can play around with the colors. You have orange, yellow, and red flame patterns to sort of play with it how you want. Also has a five year warranty. So really, really, really good seller for us. We thought we'd throw it in here. Um, I think when a Monty can include this sort of flame pattern throughout their whole product lineup, they're gonna do a lot better. For example, there's the older model. Uh, it's the TrueView XL um, in our main wall there, and you can see a big difference in the flame pattern. This has been a much better or much more popular flame pattern. Um, but anyways, we wanted to just give this little guy a shout out because it is a great seller for us and mostly it has to do with the aesthetics of the model. So that's the Amante Bespoke. All right, coming in at number five is gonna be the European Home Linea or Linea. I never know how to say it. You know, I do a lot of reviews and uh, all these brands like to use names that I never know how to pronounce. So I never know how to say any of these names in my videos. So kind of a little funny side point. So why is this coming at number five? Well, one of the reasons it's so popular is it is a 12 inch deep unit. So that can be a good, good or a bad thing. It could be bad if you don't have a lot of depth to work with. Uh, you sort of have to build out or frame out a wall around it. Um, the good news about it being so deep is it has, the ember bed has plenty of space for big full logs. So European home, they make a lot of gas fireplaces too. 
and I see some carryover between their gas fireplace logs and their electric fireplace logs, which I think, I would say out of the showroom, um, this probably has one of our best looking log sets. So if that's really important to you, definitely check out European Home. And you can see it looks really nice in here. You have plenty of depth in there. And then what's cool is they also use uh, sort of this mirrored uh, technology in here. And so what that does is it sort of makes the flame look like it's coming up out of the middle. And then there's logs on the backside, but really it's just a reflection of the logs. And then they use an anti-reflective glass on the front. And so even though it has reflection, you're not picking up a lot of pers reflection per se, which is a great feature. This is a 60 inch model. It does come in a 40 inch model. I would say, I wish they would uh, develop this technology in the 72. They have a 72, but that doesn't have some of the features we're about to show you. What is cool about it is it's a multi-sided unit. So it comes standard as a single side and you can take off the end panels and you can kind of have it open-ended like this guy here, which we'll show you. Um, you can do left corner, only one corner exposed, right corner exposed, or both ends for a double corner, which is a pretty cool look as well. All right, let's get to uh, one of the best selling things about this fireplace. I would say out of all the electric fireplaces in our showroom, it's the smartest electric fireplace. What I mean by that is I say it has the best app and easy to use app. So for example, it's thermostat controls. So I can set the thermostat to 89 degrees. And then what's the coolest thing I would say is all the different little themes that you have. So there's a spectrum theme, which gives us those cool little funky rainbow colors. And you can sort of toggle through all these cool features or you can just do like a solid red which I think looks kind of cool. You can go green. Uh, when, I'm, when I'm watching the Packers game, I'll put that one on. No, just kidding. <laughs> There's blue. And then what's really cool is I can also adjust the brightness of my flame along with the brightness of my ember bed. And I can also adjust the speed of my flame, which is really cool. And then also, this is also a little bit neat. In here as well, they have sort of some themes you can buy so that one's really cool. I like, I don't know how they're doing that on the ember bed, but it, it definitely looks like coals that are burning, which is super cool. So you can definitely play around with this one the most. And I think their app sort of works the best out of all of our electric fireplaces. So why would you buy this one? Pros. I think it has one of the most realistic log sets. I think it has the best app and the most amount of variety as far as color, colors or themes is what they call it. Uh, which is really cool. The downsides, um, and again, this is a good or bad, it does require 12 inches of depth, so it's not gonna be a fit for everybody if you only have a two by four wall to install something in. This may not be the best choice for you, except you could build it out in front of a two by four and have the open ends. I think that's a pretty good look as well. This is the European Home Linnea, definitely one of our best sellers. It's pricey though. Um, it's one of our more expensive electric fireplaces, but definitely worth checking out. Again, I sort of breeze through those features. Check out the full length video if you want the full details on this guy. Let's move on to number four. All right, coming in at number four is going to be the Modern Flames Landscape Pro Series, the Slim and the Multi. Okay, so these are essentially the same fireplace minus a couple differences, which we'll tell you about. But for simplicity's sake, the biggest difference between these two off the bat, of course, is going to be the depth. The Pro Multi is gonna be a 12 inch depth, and then the Slim does fit in a two by six wall. So again, depending on your size or install constraints, that's gonna be something to look at. Now, why does this in the top five? Why did the Landscape Pro make the top five? Well, we love our, guy, our buddies at Modern Flames. Um, super awesome guys. And what, I think what sets Modern Flames apart um, with another brand that we'll talk about here, but what happens is a lot of times people are buying sort of off the shelf type product or, or they're distributing it and someone else is designing it, which happens all the time in um, retail, not just our industry, but all over the place. What's really cool about Modern Flames is they're based out of Phoenix. They do all of their R&D or research and development. They design their own units down in Phoenix. And so I think their creativity to their products is really unique and they definitely invest time and energy in that. And I think it also helps their quality control. You'll see, um, you know, in a lot of commercial locations like Wendy's or if you're in any Marriott's, you'll probably see Modern Flames products. 
And so they are commercial grade type units. They're, they're designed to be running all day long in these commercial applications. And so I really like their quality. And I would say out of the five, they're definitely near the top when it comes to their customer service. So their customer uh, service with us, their response times with us uh, is exceptional. So the brand itself is a really, really strong brand. Um, that's one of the reasons they made the top five. And then since they've redeveloped these new units, I really like the flame pattern, which we'll talk about. Um, it's sort of, it's, they have a really nice contrast with that black background while getting those, the, the lights to sort of dissipate without feeling washed out, if that makes sense. Um, and so we develop a nice contrast. They do use RGB LED lights, which is a nice upgrade. Um, we'll talk about some of the differences between these two now. Um, with the multi, of course, with the 12 inch depth, we get a bigger ember bed, just like the European home, so we can fit a larger log set. Also like the European home, we can take off end panels. So we're gonna have a lot of install options. They do make with the multi some pretty cool um, mantle cabinets. So we can you know, flush mount it in the wall with just a little bit sticking out, or we can have the whole thing sticking out. So a lot more install variety with the Pro Multi. Also with the Pro Multi, we have the option for 120 volt or 240 volt. Now the upgrade with the 240s, we're gonna get double the heat output, which is really nice. If you're interested in a lot of heat, that might be an option for you. Also with the Pro Multi is we have a 100% clean face. So you can see there's no trim around this at all, which is really nice if you like that super clean face look. Now, what about the slim? Are there any advantages to the slim uh, besides just the depth? Well, it is 120 only, but personally, there's a lot that I like about the slim. For example, one feature that they offer here is uh, no glass. So you can take the glass front off, which I think is the best feature of this fireplace, and then put on this InvisiMesh screen. The idea is when we have no glass on here, I mean, we have lights on in here. Do you see any glare at all, Chris? You picking up anything? Nothing, I didn't even see. Yeah. I think there was glass. Yeah, that's because there's not. Yeah. <laughs> uh, but uh, this is great, great install application. I would say if you're in putting this in a room with a ton of natural light, maybe some huge bay windows, floor ceiling, ceiling windows, you have a ton of sunlight into the room. I think this is an awesome option. Also, with it being slimmer, your ember bed is slimmer, but that flame is more flame forward, which personally I just think is a more attractive look. And then we'll just kind of give you some features. These features are gonna be the same between units, but we have a full color wheel. So I can change the color of the flame, any color I want. Then I can change the ember bed color, any color I want, which that is more pronounced on the deep versus the slim because our ember bed is just smaller. And then it does have a top light, which again is not as pronounced on the slim model. I kind of like it. My personal favorite is sort of this orange red. And then I like the flame more of like a, oh, that's the flame. Kind of like it more like there. That's, that's what I like. Then our ember bed, kind of like a blue purple. I think that looks kind of cool right there. That's just me though. Um, but that's why I love this unit, is I love the anti-reflection. To me, that is a killer, killer feature. No other electric fireplace that I've seen has this cool InvisiMesh screen, so it's really unique in that way. What else is really cool about the Pro Series is it comes in a ton of sizes. So I think it goes almost up to 100 inch, 96 inch, and everything in between starts at like 40 inch up to 100 with a ton of sizes in between. So what are the pros? to Modern Flames. Pros is great quality control, great customer service from the brand itself. Um, it's R&D and designed here in the United States. Uh, ton of install options and a ton of sizes. What's bad about it? Not a lot. Not a lot bad about it. It's, right in the, it's priced right in the middle, really reasonably priced, really good quality, exceptional unit. That's why it's in the top five. Let's move on to number three. All right, time for number three, and this is gonna be the Dimplex Optimus series. Okay, so for, with the Dimplex Optimus series, um, you guys have probably seen a ton of my videos on their stuff. The Optimus technology has been around now for quite a while, and I feel like the longer it's around, the more better. That's not right. 
<laughs> that's not right grammar, the better the product gets. Um, they just keep sort of tweaking it and dialing it and honing it in. Um, so first let's go through the install configurations. So the Optimist, um, you can buy it several different ways. This is one of the complete boxes. This is a 40 inch box and you can buy it in a 40 and a 60 inch box. That's one of my, I wouldn't call it frustrations, but I do think they could offer, and I do think down the road it's gonna become available, more size configure, box size configurations to make it easier for the consumer. Um, you can do it with or without logs. I would say with the log set, um, it's one of our more realistic looking, dare I say the most realistic looking electric fireplace we have. They have a new Faber unit, which we'll show you in a second, because they're really done a lot with this technology. What's cool about it too is uh, it does have, I would say the most three dimensional flame because it's not using LED lights technology. It's actually using water vapor, um, sort of like a humidifier type technology in here. And so it does give us the most realistic flame, I think, and that's because of just simply the fact that it's three dimensional. It does require 16 inches, roughly, I could be off on that an inch or two, but it, anyways, it does require a good chunk of depth. So you definitely have to have depth to accommodate it. You can run a water line to this, um, or you can fill up the tanks. I will say with the logs, it's pretty easy to fill up the tanks because all these logs are connected. So I can just lift this log set out, take the tank out, fill it up with water, and put it back. If you're doing like a modern crushed glass or river rock, it can be kind of annoying to you know, scoot everything out of the way to get to that water tank as well. Now let's talk about quality. Here's one of my favorite things about Dimplex is this guy has a two year warranty. Um, I think one of the best things Dimplex has going for them besides being the leaders in the industry is uh, much like Modern Flames, you know, they are indeed their own products, spend a lot of time on research and development. Uh, a lot of money gets invested into that to offer some of the best products around. Um, this is the coolest part about Dimplex, which we'll be talking about this later in the video because it's not the only Dimplex in our top five. Um, they, their warranty doesn't cover just parts. It covers, covers labor too. Now the coolest thing is, is if you buy this from an authorized retailer, whether you're buying it local or not, so if you're buying from somebody that's authorized to sell Dimplex, that's a really important feature. You have to make sure you're buying from an authorized retailer for this to happen. They will warranty your labor too. So they will actually send somebody to your house as long as, it, again, we cannot emphasize enough, purchase from an authorized retailer that's authorized to be selling Dimplex products. Okay, now like I said, Dimplex has been uh, doing a lot with the Optimist technology and they sort of came out with this other brand called Faber. Fabre, Faber C is another brand that's kind of throwing me for a loop. And uh, it's more of like a sealed box type style. Now they come out with gas and electric. We'll include links below if you want to check out the gas videos that we'll have on them. But essentially what they've done is they've made this a fully contained sealed box. Now this does a lot of things. One, if you're walking by it, you can see it's not going to affect the flame, which is one of the I guess small issues you could have with optim the Optimist technology is because that's just water vapor is wind or, or even body movements can affect your flame pattern. With a sealed bo box, that is not a problem. And there's also a fan in the top of this box, which we talk about in our full length video, which is sort of sucking that flame up. So I think this is the tallest flame you'll see um, in a water type technology. Don't you think Chris is a pretty tall flame? It is pretty tall, at least a foot. Yeah, so I mean, it's, it's a big old flame. And I think this exact setup is the most realistic electric fireplace I've seen, period. I think this is the best looking electric. If, pe if people were gonna be like, whoa, whoa, what is that? Is that fireplace? Oh my gosh, I had to look twice. That's this fireplace. They're probably not gonna say it quite like that, but you get the point. I think out of everything we're reviewing today, this is by far the most realistic. I do think it has a couple drawbacks though. Um, one, it's really expensive. So it's a drawback on your pocketbook. And the only thing I don't like about it, actually two things, it doesn't have a heater, which is not a big deal for some of you, but if you like heat, the Faber unit is gonna be a deal breaker for you. You're gonna have to go with the Optimus box, which we showed you before. That guy does have a heater. The only other thing I don't like with this is you do need air access. So we designed it here because everything's black so you can barely see it. 
You could do it, I mean, there's a lot of creative ways to hide this, but it's essentially air intake. And aesthetically, I don't love that you have to have this. Those are probably the only two drawbacks with the Faber series is having the air intake and no heater. But again, if you're in Florida, this again goes back to your personal needs. If your personal needs are you don't need a heater, there's not a drawback for you. So again, think about what your needs are. But by far, this is the most realistic electric fireplaces I've electric fireplace that I personally have seen, and that's the Faber series. Okay, coming in at number two is a brand new product to North America. This is the Net Zero Fireplace. They call it the Water Place, coming in at number two. Okay, so much like our friends at Dimplex, um, this is really one of the only other electric fireplaces that we see uh, in the marketplace today that's using water as its fuel source or its technology source. Now, why did we rank it higher than the Optimist? A couple reasons. Like we said, it is new to North America. It's been around for quite a while in Europe, but I'm gonna go through a few features that um, we know one of the main reasons we really just ranked it higher. Um, the most obvious reason you can see right off the bat, what's it have, Chris? I just said the Optimus doesn't have. Color. Color. So that's the biggest thing is basically we have a second LED light strip in here, and which I think is really cool because what you're seeing happen is it's not one strip that changes colors. It's got one strip that's always orange and then a rear light strip that changes the color. So you sort of see that two-tone color, which gives us that really, really cool effect. And of course we can make it, I can set it on any color I want. You know, you can make it all orange. It does come with remote control. But uh, the uh, most obvious feature upgrade to this is gonna be the color upgrade. Now it does have some other upgrades. Is one, it has an app. So we can control everything on our phone if we want to, which is really cool. From a functionality standpoint and install standpoint, let's talk about that for a little bit. Um, I really like that it doesn't need, you don't see any air slots in here. It doesn't need any air slots, which is a great feature. And then also like we talked about, um, if you're, you have multiple ways to run, get water to this, is you can plumb it uh, or you can fill up tanks in here by hand. But what else is really cool is it has this little plug here and this is a water pump. So I can essentially set a hose up to this and then fill this up with water that way, which is really, really awesome because like I was saying, it would be a huge pain in the butt to scrape out all this glass in order to get tanks out of there. So that's a really cool feature that I like as well. Um, as far as install goes, this, these units come in 20, 40, or 60. And then they also have really cool boxes that they sit in. Um, where you can do them single-sided, you know, single corner or open corner as well, which is really cool. Now, as far as a complaint standpoint, um, like the Dimplex Faber unit, it doesn't have a heater. So again, think about your individual needs, but no heating option right now as well. As far as media choices, we could do like this glass. They also have some really cool new log sets coming out and some panels that are gonna sit on the background, which are also really cool. Um, so a ton of really cool media options as well. And then as far as uh, other feature points, what do you think about the flame, Chris, compared to the other model? It's not as high, but the color makes it so much cooler to me. Yeah, I would agree with that. So the Optimist flame, I think, has a fuller flame. Um, and again, you can watch my full-length video on this, but this has more separation, I guess you could say. Um, where it sort of creates more contrast. It's, I call it like a wispiness in the flame pattern. And then you also have more flexibility. It's got a really cool speed feature. So I can turn the flame up. See how it's like rattling off real fast now? I'm gonna change the color on it. There we go. And then you can also slow it way, way down and sort of make it like a lazy flame. You like it fast or slow? I like the slow flame. Yeah, so that's really slow there. What else is really cool about this is it has a, a feature in this that helps sort of kill bacteria or mold. Um, I haven't really seen that as an issue with water, but anytime you have water in a setting like this, I guess it could always potentially be an issue. I haven't really seen that on any of the water uh, fireplaces that we sell, but it is kind of cool to know that it has it. Um, as far as things that I don't like about it, I would say its biggest drawback is the price. It is 
stinking expensive. It is considerably more um, than the Dimplex. And so if price is a, an object for you, um, if you're on a budget, this may not be the best choice for you due to how expensive it is. Um, and I, I do think the reason you would buy this is like Chris said, I think it's cooler. Um, with the, all the multicolor and the, the app control and the ability to control the speed, it's, it's just a little bit more fun. I do think the Dimplex, especially in the Faber environment, is still mo the most realistic option, but this is a more fun option. And so because of all the variety it has, that's why we sort of ranked it at, no at number two. And uh, again, the reason it's so high in our rankings too is just the water technology. The ability to have that three-dimensional flame, I think, is second to none as far as a visual appearance. So that's why this guy's coming in at number two. Again, our biggest complaints are no blower and the price. It could be cost prohibitive for some customers. What do I love about it? I love the multicolor. I love you can change the speed settings. Um, and I love the fact that it's app controlled. All super cool stuff. All right, coming in at number one is the Dimplex Ignite series. So this is old faithful, old reliable. I did this video, I don't know, probably a year and a half, two years ago. Still can't be taken down. It's still the champ. Let me tell you why. So the Ignite really comes in two series. We have the regular Ignite XL, and then we have the Ignite Bold. You guys have been asking for updates on the Bold. I also included an update in this video as well. I was originally waiting for the Bold to show up to do our new top five. It, when it got delayed again, I decided, you know what? I can't wait anymore. I got to do this top five video. So we're doing it without the Bold. Um, I have a little preview of the Bold if you want to go back and check it out. Essentially what the Bold is, it's a bigger version of this, cleaner face line and deeper unit with some other feature upgrades that you can go check out. Right now it's unavailable. I'm guessing, they're saying spring 2022. I would, I would guess it'd be end of 2022. So if you're waiting on a bold or waiting to buy a bold or wanted an update on it, just figure at least, you know, from the time I'm shooting this video, I would say at least a year before you'd get your hands on one. Um, so for now, we just have the regular Ignite. Why does it make our number one? Remember I talked about Dimplex's warranty. They have the best warranty support. Again, if you're buying from authorized retailers, there's a lot of people online selling that aren't authorized to sell this product. Um, make sure you're buying from an authorized source. It's really important. Um, they have the best warranty, hands down. Five years. So for five years, parts and labor, they're gonna send someone to your house to fix it. Unmatched, untouched, no one else is even close. So from a warranty standpoint, end of story, it's a longer warranty than all of other Dimplex's product and Dimplex has the best warranty process easily. So for that reason, from a warranty standpoint, it's number one. From a performance standpoint, this product has the quietest, most efficient, and best heater. So it has the best performance, hands down. I have another video where I take this thing apart and show you guys the heater. I'll include a link below. Definitely check that out, but it's the quietest. So if heat's important to you, this easily has the best heater. This particular guy fits in a two by four or two by six application. If it's a two by four application, it's gonna stick out a little bit. They sell a really cool flame for it, frame for it. So it really fits in any install application. Let's talk about price. It is middle priced, middle to high. So it's not the most expensive unit. I would say it's very fairly priced and uh, it really checks the box there because it's affordable for most electric fireplace consumers. Let's talk aesthetics. I would say in uh, LED technology, it is a fan favorite from the way the flame looks. So I still think the Optimist has the most realistic flame, but the water, uh, the depth that it requires, the cost, it's just not practical for everybody. Out of the LED technologies, this by far is a fan favorite. The reason is, is again, they have a really nice contrast be the, between the bright orange flame and the black background. And again, that flame, like I like with the landscape slim, that flame is very flame forward. So it's near the front and it looks like your media sits in behind it. The glass does come standard with it. You can also order a log set for it. The flame always stays orange, 
but we can toggle through all of our colors here on our ember bed to sort of change it how we want. That's with it off. And again, you know, I kind of go with majority rules on this because it is so subjective, electric fireplaces. Just dealing with customers in here, it is easily a fan favorite uh, with this flame. It is hands down our best seller. And it's our best seller because it's well-priced. It installs in almost every application, it has the longest and best warranty. And from an LED standpoint, it has probably cosmetically the best flame. Boom, end of story. Game over, game, set, match, point. Michael Scott. Uh, best selling fireplace, definitely ranked number one. I don't think anything's touching it anytime soon. This is the Dimplex Ignite XL. Sorry for the bad news on the bold, but easily the best fireplace Dimplex makes. I think Dimplex is the strongest electric fireplace brand that's out there. And best selling fireplace, best quality fireplace, best electric fireplace, period. Dimplex Ignite XL. Now I'm saying that as a matter of fact, I told you guys it's subjective, but this is a landslide, our number one electric fireplace, Dimplex Ignite XL. Okay, so there's my top five electric fireplaces. Um, as I was doing this video, I'm like, man, I'm, this is a lot of information. Uh, these were just the bullet points too. So hopefully I didn't confuse, confuse you guys more. Again, think about what your personal needs are, what's important to you, you know, functionality, is heat important? Is it not important? Visually, what's most important? What's your budget? Think about all those things, compile the information I've given you here to make an educated choice. So hopefully that helps you out. Again, this is just sort of a guideline. If you have any questions, call or text our staff. Don't forget to subscribe for more videos. Stay tuned for more. We'll see you guys next time.